CompTIA ITF Plus, FC 0-U61, Practice Exam. Questions 111 through 115. This video is part of our practice exam video series, and is filled with questions that closely resemble the real exam. So are you prepared to test your knowledge? Great, let's begin. Question 111. Which of the following functions is performed by the GPU on a graphics card? The answer is D. Processing. The primary function of the GPU, or graphics processing unit, on a graphics card is processing. The GPU handles complex calculations related to visual rendering, thereby offloading these tasks from the main CPU and ensuring smoother, more efficient visual performance, particularly in graphic-intensive applications like gaming, video editing, and 3D rendering. Question 112. A remote employee notices the stock market website they frequently check shows the morning stock figures in the afternoon, despite several page refreshes. What's the most likely reason for this outdated information? The answer is A. Proxy server. The answer points to the proxy server because a proxy server can sometimes serve outdated content. Proxy servers are intermediate servers that store copies of web content for quicker access. However, if the proxy doesn't update its stored content regularly or fails to recognize that the website has updated information, it will continue to deliver the old data it has saved. This scenario is consistent with the user's experience of seeing outdated information despite refreshing the page. Question 113. Which form of encryption would be most effective in securing data on a laptop if it were stolen? The answer is A. Disk. Full disk encryption is the most effective method for protecting data on a stolen laptop because it encrypts the entire hard drive, including both system and user files. This comprehensive approach ensures that unauthorized users cannot access the encrypted data, making the information unreadable and useless to thieves without the correct decryption key. Question 114. Which of the following would a developer choose to most efficiently store all the months of the year? The answer is A. In an array. Given the options, an array would be the optimal choice for storing the months of the year. Storing each month as separate objects or string variables would not only be cumbersome but also inefficient, especially when performance is a key consideration. Arrays consolidate this data into a single, manageable container, allowing for faster access and better performance. Additionally, arrays avoid the unnecessary overhead of dynamic resizing as would be the case with a vector. Question 115. What issue does installing cross-platform software solve? The answer is D. Compatibility. Installing cross-platform software addresses compatibility issues, ensuring that the software can run on multiple operating systems or environments. This approach eliminates the need for different versions for each system, thereby simplifying deployment and user experience across diverse platforms. Now, did you stumble on any of these questions? If you did, no worries, it happens. Just remember, our free CompTIA ITF Plus training course is your secret weapon to mastering these topics. Access it through our YouTube channel, anytime you feel the desire to learn more. Thank you for watching. Subscribe for more great content.